Hello everyone, another video from Super Easy Math. Today we will talk about prime factorization, but before we start, it's your channel, so please subscribe. What is prime factorization? It's simply converting a composite number into a product of prime numbers. So we have a composite number, it's equal to several prime numbers multiplied by each other. For example, 12. First of all, these are some prime numbers so here we have 12 which is a composite number we convert it to 3 times 4 3 is a prime number so we circle it what about 4 it's a composite number so we will convert it to 2 times 2 these are prime numbers so 12 is equal to 3 times 2 times 2 you can check it 3 times 2 equal to 6 times 2 equal to 12 so here we have a composite number we convert it to several prime numbers multiplied by each other this process is called prime factorization you might ask yourself can we write 12 as 2 times 6 yes of course we can so 2 is a prime number what about 6? It's a composite number. It's equal to 2 times 3. Both of them are prime numbers. So it will be equal to 2 times 2 times 3. So we will get the same solution. And now we can transform it to exponent form. So it's equal to 3 times 2 exponent 2. Another example. 32. So think about two factors multiplied by each other and give 32. So we can say 4 times 8 or 16 times 2. You can use any one of them. What about 4 times 8 for example? So 8 times 4. So 4 is a composite number and 8 also is a composite number. 4 is equal to 2 times 2. So these are two prime numbers we will circle them 8 is equal to 4 times 2 so 2 is a prime number we will circle it also 4 is equal to 2 times 2 which are two prime numbers so we can write 32 equal to 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 5 times or so it's equal to 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 or 2 exponent 5. If you want to write it as 16 times 2, so 2 is a prime number, we have 16 equal to 8 times 2. 2 is also a prime number, 8 is equal to 4 times 2 we have 2 a prime number and 4 is equal to 2 times 2 so it's equal 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 5 times so we will get the same solution let's take another example so write the prime factorization of 90 90 we can write it as 9 times 10 9 is a composite number, it's equal to 3 times 3, so both of them are prime numbers, we will circle them, and 10 is equal to 2 times 5, so 2 prime numbers, circle them, so 90 is equal to 3 times 3 times 2 times 5. 3 times 3 equal to 9, times 2 equal to 18, times 5 equal to 90. If you want to write it in expo exponent form, it's equal to 3 exponent 2 times 2 times 5. Another example. What is the prime factorization of 225? So 225, 
let's make the three. Five is a factor of 225 because here the ones digit is five. So five times what give us 225? We can divide 225 by five and see what we will get. So five times four equal to 20. Two, five. 5 times 5 equal to 25 subtract 0 so 5 times 45 equal to 225 we know that 5 is a prime number so we will circle it 45 is a composite number we can write it as 5 times 9 5 is also a prime number so we will circle it 9 is a composite, we can write it as 3 times 3. So these two 3's are prime numbers, so we will circle them. So 225 is equal to 5 times 5 times 3 times 3, which is the answer B. So this prime factorization method is called 3 short. We have another method which is division line so for example if we are asked to find the prime factorization of 24 using division what we will do here are prime numbers so here we will divide the 24 by the first prime number here we have two 2 is divisible by 24, so we will divide 24 by 2. So 24 divided by 2 equal to 12. 12 is the same, it's divisible by 2. And the 3, we can choose any one of them. So 12 divided by 2 equal to 6. 6 divided by 3, for example, equal to 2. And 2 divided by 2 equal to 1. When the answer here is equal to 1, then the division is end. So 24 is equal to 2 times 2 times 3 times 2. Or if you want to write it in exponent form, it's equal to, so 24 is equal to 2 times 2 times 3 times 2. It's equal to 2 cubed times 3 let's take another example so find the prime factorization of 108 so prime numbers here 108 is div divisible by 2 2 times what give us 108 you can divide them it's equal to 54 54 also is divisible by 2 so 2 times 27 is equal to 54 27 is divisible by 3 so 27 divided by 3 equal to 9 and 9 is divisible by 3 also so 9 divided by 3 equal to 3 and 3 is divided by 3 is equal to 1 so here the answer is 1 then 108 is equal to 2 times 2 times 3 times 3 times 3 equal to 2 exponent 2 times 3 exponent 3. In the next video, we will explain how to use prime factorization to find the LCM and GCD of two natural numbers. Stay tuned. Goodbye.